हेलो स्टूडेंट्स सो टू डे आई विल बी स्टार्टिंग चैप्टर नंबर नाइन दैट इज रिप्रोडक्शन इन एनिमल्स सो व्हाट इज एक्चुअली रिप्रोडक्शन स्टूडेंट्स सम ऑफ द एनिमल्स आर देयर दे हैव देयर ओन लाइफ साइकिल दे कैन ग्रो दे कैन बिकम ओल्ड एंड देन दे डाई दिस स्टेजेस आर एक्चुअली कॉल्ड इज लाइफ साइकिल नाउ ऑल लिविंग थिंग्स हैव देयर ओन लाइफ साइकिल they can produce their young ones hmm they produce their own kind of babies so that life on the earth can continue animals reproduce in different ways just like mammals lions humans they give birth to babies they reproduce they multiply their cells multiply and then they give rise to their young ones that is babies birds and frogs they lay eggs from which babies hatch okay Another topic which is given is animals that give birth to babies. There are some animals like humans, lion, tigers and many examples are given here. They give birth to babies. The babies are formed inside the body of the mother. Okay. Now, they uh, the babies stays for a week or months and uh, before they are born. When the babies they are born, they are very weak, they are helpless, they need support. So some of them they cannot even walk. their mothers they care for them and protect them the mothers which give rise to babies which uh, which gives birth to babies they feed them with their own milk those animals are called as mammals okay now another topic is there that is animals that lay eggs some of the animals like birds frogs snakes they all lays eggs okay some of the birds they uh, they sometimes build nests on the trees and then they lay eggs okay the female bird lays the eggs not the male bird okay now as you can see here there is a picture of a egg okay the structure of a hen's egg is there in the center you can see a yellow portion it is called as the yolk okay and at its top there is a developing baby from where a baby starts growing which is called as embryo okay surrounding the entire yolk surrounding the entire yolk there is a white portion liquid white portion which is called as albumen okay it protects the embryo and provides water and nourishment to the embryo after the eggs are laid after the eggs are laid then what happens the parent birds they usually uh, the parent birds either of the parent birds they usually uh, sit on the eggs and then they keep the eggs warm this is called as the incubation okay the baby birds then start growing they become mature and after a few weeks the baby birds they fully develop and then they come out of the shell okay the parent birds then feed them and protect their young birds until they look after themselves okay so this is the first part of this chapter in the next video i will be giving about i will be explaining about the life cycle of frogs then uh, butterflies and other uh, egg laying animals okay